guys, I am, I know I've been talking about this wedding for like in every vlog, but that's literally what's going on in my life right now. I have to go to pay the makeup artist right now and I have to run more errands and then try to um, start organizing all the decorations and the centerpieces and all that for the bridal shower this weekend, this Saturday. It's only two days away, oh my God. I'm getting a headache right now because <laughs> I'm freaking out, but everything will be fine. So yeah, I'm gonna go do that and I will check in with you guys later. What are you barking at? I'm home now, but not for long. I'm literally just gonna eat a little bit of my salad. And Max, I don't know, there's no one out there. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm just gonna eat a little bit of my salad. Then I have to run to Walmart, try to find these organza bags for the party favors because I want to put them in little cute organza bags. I saw them on Walmart online. Hopefully they have them when I go in the store because it says that you can't like pick it up in store. Like you have to either order it or I guess go and see, pray that they have it. This is the mess that I'm dealing with right now. It's actually not that bad. <laughs> and I have a couple more bags in uh in the car what am i saying i ordered i ordered the new lumi case the lumi 2 by kim this is the summer limited edition i believe in the blush tone i just love blush tone like it's my favorite color it has to be my favorite color i love blush tone i said i wasn't gonna order from lumi again because my other lumi case that i have the last one that i ordered i got the black one and i swear i think i have a defective one or something because the lighting is yellow and ugly so i was like i'm just i'm not gonna use it i'm not gonna get it again but then this one is supposed to be a little slimmer looks kind of big to me but it's supposed to be a little slimmer i haven't opened it so i'm gonna compare it um for you guys to my other lumi see if it's really that much slimmer and if the lighting is any better i hope it is because this was expensive i need water I went to the farmer's market and I just got a salad because I have literally no time to prepare anything um, once the wedding is over I'll like try to go back to doing my like little meal preps they're really simple but it works for me that way I don't eat poorly last week I ate really poorly if you guys watched by one of my last vlogs oh my god i just kept eating so bad mainly because i was getting my period tmi but the week before i get my period sometimes i just get these uncontrollable like cravings and i eat super bad so now that i have it like now that my it's over like i'm back to normal i'm like i want a salad but i got a greek salad it looks really yummy it just has a bunch of veggies like and it has mozzarella cheese tomatoes cucumbers um cilantro i don't know what these are but i don't think i like it all right so really quick because i have to head out again um got the both cases so i can compare this is like not the original Lumi. This is like then the newer one they came out with. Like they kind of modeled it a little different. But do you see how this light is yellow? I don't know if you guys are able to tell. But now, now that I'm looking at it again, I'm like, oh my god, it's so yellow. It's so yellow. Ugh. This shit better not be yellow. I'm going to be pissed. You know what would make the Lumi case the best case ever? Is if one, the lighting is not yellow and it's actually like white and perfect for selfies. And two, if it was also a charging case. Because then I would like never need another case again. Oh. So you got a little cable to charge it. I'll just keep that there for now. You got little instructions. But I mean, do we really need instructions? I don't think so. I don't even know if the lighting is picking up on the blush color there we go it's a little better it says press and hold to dim i do like that the lights are dimmable that's pretty cool any day any day that you would like to stop barking that would be all right i'm gonna turn it on so i could see um 
if it's yellow lighting or if it's not. Oh, it's very bright. It has a hint of yellow, kind of, but it's not like... Wow, the light is so much more powerful. You see how that glows? I'm gonna make this like the brightest ever. Okay, it's completely off. Now I'm holding it down so that it can get super bright. That is as bright as... It wow, that's nothing. Oh my God, that is a huge difference. Okay. Maybe I have a defective case, I don't know, but this is really powerful, wow. Cool, okay, okay. They might have redeemed themselves. As for thinner design, it's slightly thinner. Slightly thinner. The raised bumper, ew, even the raised bumper on mine is yellow. So the raised bumper looks pretty much the same, but then the actual shell case is a little bit thinner on the Lumi 2 than opposed to the black one. I feel like you can't really tell just looking at it like this, but it is slightly thinner, slightly. It's not, a, it's not looking like a big difference to me. Hi, baby. Mm, I love you so much, I love you so much. He got such a short haircut, that's why he looks all skinny and little. Look at how cute our party favors are. It's all by Sugarfina. They make the best candy. So I got these little rose gummy bears. And then the other half are the sugar lips. These are two of my favorites. And then I got these tags made that say thank you, Elva's bridal shower, and then the date. And then I'm gonna put um I'm gonna put each in one of these little organza bags. All right, we did all the party favors. Now we're gonna spray paint the bottles to see how it looks. Chris is gonna do the first one. All right. Because I'm gonna turn it over. Oh, that's smart. I know. Innovate. Ah! Oh yeah, let me get it. Go get it. Innovative. It looks so good already. Oh, we're spray painting all of them. That looks too good, right? Oh my God, that looks amazing. Wait, let me do a really quick close up for you guys. Look at that, that's only the first coat. Look how beautiful that looks. And I think the can said that the first coat will, would go on a little more translucent. So, And look how good that looks. Look at him admiring his work. Look at how good these came out and that's only one coat. We still gotta do another coat. What? Oh yeah, the wind. I cannot believe this rain. Ew, I'm in front of a yellow light. I kind of want to move my car just so I can talk to you guys. Ew, this yellow light is horrific. I ran out the house really early, but I threw in some makeup in here because I wanted to save some time and just quickly do my makeup in the car before my next appointment. I have an appointment that I kind of want to look decent for, so. I was like, let me put a little makeup on so it looks like I actually care and put myself together. Before I left the house, I put on skincare and I put on primer. So I am just gonna dive into the actual makeup. I'm gonna use my CoverGirl Healthy Elixir Foundation. I love, yes, that light went off. I love this foundation so much. It's honestly pretty amazing. And I did a self tanner last night, so I felt like, I feel like that's giving me a little boost. Like helping me look a little better. This morning, I wanna be tan for the bridal shower tomorrow. Oh my God, tomorrow's a bridal shower, finally. I'm so happy that it's raining today and it looks like it's gonna be sunny tomorrow because I was freaking out because I didn't really prepare for rain. Like I rented umbrellas for the, sh for some shade, but 
I really, in my heart, believed it wouldn't rain, and now it's not gonna rain. So yay! I'm parked outside the coffee shop. This coffee flavor is, I think it's my favorite. I got fudge brownie nut iced coffee. Oh my god. So damn good. I already know. Tape Chip Concealer. It's my favorite. I think I've been using it non-stop since I got it. It really is pretty amazing. I didn't even get a chance to wet my beauty blender, but we don't have time today. Whenever I don't have eye primer, I just put my concealer on my eyelids. I feel like it tones down the redness because my eyelids for some reason get a little red. And then it also serves as a base. But hopefully by the time I'm done with my makeup, I feel like I have to yell so you guys can hear me over the rain. Hopefully by the time I'm done with my makeup, uh, the rain has calmed down. Because I do not like being out in the rain. I like being home in the rain. This translucent setting powder is my favorite product of the moment I keep it in my bag at all times with this little fluffy brush they're both by a cosmetics and whenever I get shiny throughout the day or I need to touch up I literally just take this fluffy brush and just put it all over my face and it tones down the shine so this is great for summer and I'm using it to set my concealer now because I forgot my powder but this is less messy which I kind of prefer Just a little baby contour. I'm going to use my Hoola bronzer. And then I'm going to take a fluffier brush and just get a broader application. A little blush. Why not? Why not? I'm using my Wet n Wild highlight in Precious Petals. Get a little highlight up there. Almost at the finish line. I'm gonna fill in my brows a little bit. Yesterday I received some new brow products from Too Faced. I don't know if this is new, but it's new to me. And it's called Chocolate Brownie. How cute. Uh, it's 12 hour wear cocoa powder brow pencil and the, they sent me three shades the shade I grabbed when I was leaving out the door is deep brown because the other shades look a little light for me so let's give it a try this is what it looks like come on focus there we go it looks like there's two oh so one side is a little spoolie and then the other side what happens when you get ready in the car. The other side is the actual product. It reminds me of the Anastasia brow definer. But I actually just ran out of my Anastasia brow wiz yesterday. Um, and I think I have a new one stocked somewhere, but since this arrived, I was like, let me give this a try. Ooh, I am liking this. Oh my god, it smells like chocolate too. Mm. I really like the brow product. These are my brows filled in and I look crazy because I'm like all in the camera, but um, it was really easy to use. It, I like the way it makes the lines underneath like so precise. I really love that. It smells good. As you're applying it, you can smell it. It smells really good. And first impression is I really like this product. Oh, little setting spray and then I'm gonna do my mascara. And this is the Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1 Replenishing Primer and Setting Spray. I really like this spray. You have to be a little bit careful because when you spray it, it really wets your face. Like it's like water being splashed on you. So try to do it a little bit far and don't spray too much. Um, other than that, it has like a little sticky factor. Not an uncomfortable sticky. But you could tell like that sticky factor is what's gonna hold your makeup in place. It's it's not it's not bad. It's not bad. I kinda like it. And it smells like coconut. It's super your skin literally feels refreshed. Like you have this cooling feeling. I'm gonna use my Maybelline Big Shot Colossal. Ooh. 
for lips, I'm gonna do my Kat Von D lip liner in, what is this Jay? D minor. And then the Kim Kardashian cream lipstick in Kimmy. Let's get it done, honey. I gotta go, I got things to do. You know what, I really like how the lip liner looks alone, so I'm just gonna rock the lip liner today by itself. All right, let's get out of here. Off to the next destination.